I am in the daytime kitchen with local blogger Becky Ellis from BubblyBee.net. Today we are talking about champagne and chocolate. I love that so much. I like chocolate. I like champagne. I've never actually had them together. I feel like usually you typically think wine and chocolate, but champagne goes just as well, right? Absolutely. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's and, um, Day. Yes, it is. Um, an art to it as far as pairing because just like you wouldn't want to throw together just any boy and girl and expect them to be a perfect pair yeah. you don't want to throw together any chocolate and champagne and just expect them to pair together so we're looking for the perfect match and I think we found okay. them today great so we're not gonna get into that just yet we're gonna save that for the grand finale but we do want to talk about uh, chocolate can make you feel as if you're falling in love. Yes. And mm -hmm. then champagne is kind of for celebration, right? Celebration. So mm -hmm. we're basically celebrating love, which is exactly what Valentine's Day is, right? Absolutely. Great. So give us the, the quick rundown of, of just the three champagnes you'll be pairing, and then we'll get into well, the chocolate. These are wine. actually sparkling wines, so they are um, well within anybody's budget Great. and won't break the bank. Uh, we also have a couple of them I've brought for display that are a little bit of the more expensive varieties. Great. But these are, um, I have two French and one California Great. and two are pink which is very special for Valentine's Day and I think you're gonna really enjoy them I absolutely will I can't wait we gotta wait for Natalie though okay. Natalie won't be happy <laughs> if we start eating the chocolate and drinking the champagne before her so we'll be right back don't go anywhere you're watching daytime Blue Ridge We are in the daytime kitchen with local blogger Becky Ellis from BubblyBee.net. Great to see you. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to you. And this makes me very, very happy, all of this <laughs> right here. But we're going to be pairing champagne sparkling wine with mm -hmm. chocolate. With chocolate, correct. And, and that's the perfect pairing. Perfect pairing. Why is that? Um, they just go so well together, the creaminess of the chocolate and then the, the different flavor notes that you have in the chocolate as well as the champagne. Mm -hmm. When you pair those together, they really, the flavors just pop. Yeah, and I'm so excited. But you have to be to careful that. when pairing them, right? You do. And I did okay. a lot of investigation, Good. a lot of study on this. I'm <laughs> sure it was a hard we was a lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, where do we start? This is the first one. This is um, a French sparkling wine, okay. uh, okay. River Rosé. Mm -hmm. And um, this will go, because it has oh, strawberry notes, yeah. mm -hmm. um, it will go with a white chocolate truffle that has strawberry. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It has just a beautiful label. I love the label on this. Okay, so this is, okay, so this goes with this. Now, why is this a great combo? Well, it has a little tiny oh. bit of strawberry in the white chocolate truffle, mm -hmm. and it has the strawberry notes in the champ or in the sparkling mm. wine. Mm. And it really brings it out. It really pops, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Wow. that is great. Mm -hmm. That is delicious. I love it. Okay, and then how much is, is this? This is not expensive. This one is the 15 to $20 range. Oh, all right. Easy. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Okay. And um, as you can see, you can use all different kinds of flutes. I know, I love this. For fun little Valentines. Oh, look and at this cute. one. This is so this pretty. Look, it's got glittery hearts on it. It's also <laughs> about a $16 uh, value. Mm -hmm. And it's Perrier Spar. And okay. it's a Cremant, which is right outside the Champagne region. Okay, lift that up again. Got it. And um, it, you can't call it a Champagne because it's not in the Champagne region. region. Yeah, but right. it's okay. right outside, so it has a lot of the same characteristics. Okay, all right. And this one we're going to have with a little lemonade chocolate, the little lemonade. round one here. Lemonade chocolate. And it's like okay. biting into a chocolate enrobed fresh lemon. Mm, okay. It's one okay. of my favorite chocolates All right, in the world. so let me try the... Mm -hmm. Sparkling wine, right? Mm -hmm. Sparkling wine. Right. Whoa! Okay. That is great! Where are You're you really good at this, um, Becky. These are Bailey's chocolates mm. locally. Mm. Wow, that she, is great. She hand makes all of her chocolates. That's delicious. That goes really well. Yeah. Okay. That's great. And that mm -hmm. one, um, you said, is also in the $15 to $20 range? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. We right. can afford this. This is so nice because flowers <laughs> and jewelry, so expensive. So expensive. But this is nice. Okay. It's, this one is a California uh, Chandon and also a rosé. Mm -hmm. And I love the rosé for Valentine's Day. It has that little pink special color to it. And this it's one really will go pretty. with the champagne uh, fine truffles, fine champagne truffles. Oh, okay. all right. Which is a darker chocolate. And usually with a sparkling wine, I'll stick to more of a white chocolate or milk chocolate. But mm. this one just makes this Chandon really pop too. It's going to get in my teeth and all over <laughs> my was mouth. All, that's all I was thinking is that great. I'm going to have black teeth in the front. Oh, wow, that is so good. Becky, you're amazing at yeah, this. Yeah, that works. Isn't that fun? Mm -hmm. And then you also brought a ring. Why did you did. bring the ring? Well, right. that is where you can just 
if you're going to propose on Valentine's Day, mm -hmm. you can pop your uh, traditional engagement ring in here. And we said earlier that maybe you want to get a really big diamond Probably. so that the, your new fiance won't swallow the ring. <laughs> <laughs> that is so true. That always scares me when people do that. Yeah. I'm always like, oh my God, I'm the ring. Don't swallow it, don't swallow it. I but it does that. look pretty in there. Thank you so much. Thank you. Absolutely. All right, so if we want more information, bubblybee.net for more on these champagnes and sparkling wines. Mm -hmm. The information will be there. Thank yes. you so much. Thank you. All right. Well,